Le Bénin a commencé un programme ou une initiative de... Benin has launched a new program which gathers information for an urban land registry. The urban land registry can be used as a tool for community management. The RFU was conceived as a way of bringing together land information. It is a local government tool used in at least 16 cities in Benin over the last 20 years. Cotonou, the largest city in Benin, started its RFU 18 years ago, and the work continues today. A key objective of an RFU is to undertake a land inventory. Comme chargé de superviser les équipes sur le terrain, on les positionne chaque matin après. I supervise the teams. Each morning, I allocate their work. After distributing the maps, I come back later to see if they have any difficulties. I check that they understand their work, and I check their work at the end of the day. Step two also includes the careful storing of the data. Then I send the work to be coded. It is first coded and then verified. When it is finished, I send the work back to the team processing the information. There is a verification team that checks everything is OK. When that is done, I send it to the control team. They check the information and then pass it to the computing team. This gives us a proper database to use in the future. More recently, other municipalities like WIDA have set up their own RFU. We started preliminary work up to the point that the system was set up, from mapping work all the way to the creation of a database. The person responsible for the management of this tool tries to integrate the information to the database or to modify it if needed. There is a form we use to make any changes that should be made to the database. And in the last year, the town of Semi Poggi has started its RFU journey. We have launched two kinds of inquiries, general and specific, to capture information about land tenure and taxes. Until now, we have had no major difficulties. We have benefited from training in a mapping program, which is very important for the RFU. At the town hall at Semipoggi, the RFU has two sections, fiscal and land tenure. At the land tenure section, we keep records of all the infrastructure in the town. We are also in charge of updating the land tenure database. The final step in the RFU journey is to sustain and improve the service and so continue to reap the benefits. But the process of land reform in Benin has many practical difficulties. For a start, gathering the data. We have to identify people with regard to their activities and the land they own. Don't forget that in Benin and in Africa, the difficulty is that oral traditions are more important than written. 
on a des difficultés qu'on essaie de gérer. Par exemple, les contribuables n'aiment pas, ils sont un peu réticents à notre arrivée. We have difficulties that we try to manage. For example, the taxpayer who is reluctant to give any information. There are some who refuse to see us because they don't understand the aim of our work. Some people welcome us. We do what we have to do. We take measurements. But there are people who cause us problems. Thanks to the training we have received and the experience of our elders, we've been able to confront these difficulties and to do our work well. Some people, when they see us, run away. They leave their premises. Others will insult us. And there are other challenges for RFUs, not least finding the resources to do the work properly and ensuring local sustainability. For the commune of Wida, we are still at the beginning. We are confronted with many difficulties. In the municipality of Wida, we are at the beginning of setting up an RFU. We are confronted with many difficulties. One difficulty is with regard to mapping. When the tool was set up, a map was produced, but since then it has not been updated. The difficulty is the insufficient resources on the communes. The main difficulty is the lack of resources for each town. The second problem is the technical capacity of the town hall employees to achieve the standard required for each town. These two things add up to a lot. It se fait néanmoins que le véritable problème dans la mise en œuvre du RFU, ce n'est pas l'installation de l'outil, mais c'est plutôt la pérennisation. The main problem is not the establishment of the RFU system, but to guarantee its sustainability. Each town that has established an RFU needs to be assisted and staff trained so that they can provide a regular update of information. We have proved that there is no simplified version of an RFU. It is not something magical. It requires method and people's involvement. The lesson is that the Benin RFUs have made good progress setting up urban land databases. Achieving more will require adequate resources, good organization, capable staff and much more.